Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to do this look. This is basically a, it can be an all day, or not all day, I'm sorry. It can be a daily look, which it basically is, but I just concentrated on doing a lot more highlighting so that I look more dewy and more fresh. And then I just did a bold lip and that's pretty much it. So let's get into the video. So I already prepped my face with moisturizer and some primer and I'm going in with an orange corrector for my dark circles and a few blemishes and I will be blending this out with a beauty blender. So for my base I'm taking this MAC foundation and applying it to the back of my hand and using my finger to apply that onto my face. I didn't show this but I did another coat of foundation just so I can have a full coverage because this foundation is medium to full and I'm blending it out with a beauty blender. So I'm using this dark circle eraser to highlight my face, the bridge of my nose, my forehead, my brow bone, my cheeks, and a little bit on my chin as well as right above my jawline. And this is going to give a little bit more light to my face. Now we're going to do a technique called baking, which is setting the under eyes or wherever you highlighted with an excessive amount of powder and leaving that on your face for about 2-3 to three minutes or while contouring. So after contouring, we are going to wipe away the excess powder under the eyes and I'm going to use the banana powder from the contour palette to brighten up my face a little bit more so the contour on my cheekbones are more defined. So now I'm just going to fill in my brows. If you guys want to see an eyebrow tutorial on how I fill them, just leave a comment down below and give this so now I am going to use that concealer I used to highlight my face to put under my brow bone and highlight it. So now I'm going to add some blush to the apples of my cheek and I actually really really love this blush. It's from Flower Beauty which is a Drew Barrymore line. And then I'm going to add some eyeliner from the NYX collection. This is a black liner. This is like my holy grail. I love, 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 love this. So my camera was not on when I recorded some of this, but I did put on mascara and I will be applying my Ardell Wispies as well right now. And then I'm going to pinch them together just so that they cling together a little bit better and look more like they're not fake lashes. And then I'm going to apply another coat of mascara just to now it's time to excessively highlight my face, which I'm going to currently do right now. I'm doing it on the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, my cheekbones, and my brow bone. I'm doing this just because I wanted more of a dewy look and a more fresh look. Just because I always do matte looks, but I thought it was going to be different for change. And this is a really good look during the summer. You just look so glowed up, you know? So now I'm using this translucent powder to powder my face just so that there's no excess oil on my face, especially when it comes out on camera. It doesn't a lot look good like that. And then now I'm going to be taking my liquid lipstick from LA Girls in Stunner to give that purple bold lip. So now that my face is pretty much done, I am going to go and spray my face with this setting spray from Urban Decay, which is the All Nighter. It is really great stuff, I'm telling you, like, it's the bomb diggity. 
So that's the finished look guys. I hope you guys like it. I look really, really glowed up. Like I'm super stoked. Yeah, so don't forget to subscribe guys. You guys are great. I love you guys.